Initially, uh, there was a belief that different languages have different literacy. The key, I think, to using the MOL approach is to begin small, to use one strategy and uh, be able to use that strategy both in a languages classroom and also in a classroom setting. It could be as simple as looking at the sounds within a language, what's the same and what's different. We noticed improvement in children's reading levels, uh, in their comprehension of, of texts and in using strategies to show understanding of what they're reading. We noticed vocabulary development was increasing as well in both languages. Initially we may have had some concerns about some isolation in terms of the strategies that we were using and sometimes not a lot of awareness for classroom teachers. As part of the multilingual project we particularly wanted to focus on ways that we could link what was happening in the classroom with the languages room. And uh, Melissa and I have done lots of planning with this and we decided to start off in a fairly small, manageable way and have matching, very much parallel programs in terms of the strategies, the literacy strategies that we would use um, in both areas. One of the things that we've been particularly pleasantly surprised with was the level of confidence that students have shown. We probably shouldn't have been surprised because those elements are common to all the languages, whether it be the students first, second, sometimes here third languages. So um, those literacy um, strategies apply across the board and, and we're having some very, very good success with using some of those in both settings.